Thermal treatment of facial spider veins is surrounded by many technical terms which can cause a lot of confusion. When heat is delivered to a facial spider vein via a needle, the intention is to cause a controlled injury which ultimately leads to the vein being absorbed. It heals by a fibrosis and it is removed. Sometimes it's called thermocoagulation or electrocoagulation or sometimes it's called radiofrequency ablation. I prefer the term shortwave diathermy. Many claims are made for one particular frequency of alternating current or a particular machine to deliver it. I've looked at the medical literature extensively. Based on my findings, I can recommend a method of thermal injury which has worked for me for nearly 15 years. And I've treated well over 100 patients and I use a method which is supported by the evidence.